Final day of the Illinois State Amateur Championship. Carter Stevenson of Marquette Heights nearly holes out this putt from just off the green. Four good rounds for the Bradley sophomore this week. He ties for 10th. ISU's Parker Wisdom was fifth, and fellow Redbird T.J. Barger of Bloomington takes third. Pierce Grieve of Lake Forest is your state amateur champion. Some youth basketball players from Poland found a second home in Peoria this summer, thanks in part to a former ICC All-American, Daria Miloshenka, who helped ICC win a national title in 2003, brought eight youth players from her home country to Peoria to have them, quote, experience American hoops. Through a company called Warrior Wind Training, she and her husband Sebastian want to start a regular exchange with players from Peoria and Poland. A lot of people ask me why I'm coming back to Peoria. That's, all, that's the question. I really feel like at home. I love the community here. I love the coaches here. Uh, I want to give them the same experience. So I want to give them the American exposure. I want them to uh, see the difference between American and European basketball. The players from Poland went to camps at Illinois, Bradley, ISU, and Eastern Illinois while here. But the highlight may have been their first ever trip to Walmart. When we walked into Walmart, they were overwhelmed with the choices. They asked to go down the candy aisle. And when I showed them the candy aisle at Walmart, their exact response was, whoa. Yeah. There they are in Champaign. As part of this exchange, Jared Brown, who was the host this past month, is now in Poland this week conducting clinics. We have more on this basketball exchange with the players from Poland in a story at our website, ciproud.com. The Alani Elite Summer Volleyball League continues. Morton with another good night. This is Abby Van Menen on the left side, perfectly placed shot for that point. Then Rebecca Stock from the right side finishes off that play with a kill to the back row. And then the lefty tap from Carly Whitaker. Nicely done, part of a Potter's win. Tonight, normal community looking for a good, uh, looking for a win and a good matchup with El Paso Gridley. Sam LeCamp doing her thing on the net. A couple of blocks, and then she puts away that kill. And center E.B. Mount's going to send it over to Alana Whitfield for that finish. Finally, Mount at the service line where she was very comfortable. This is a serve that's not returned, part of an iron victory. Hartsburg Emden coach Jennifer Hayes has her stags ready to play U High. The Pioneers' Levin Snow pounds that off the block for the point. Artem is the state finalist from a year ago. Emma Eaton down the middle for that kill. And then Elena Briggs at the net for a block and a point for Hardham. But here's Snow, another one for you high. It's Laney Snow this time. The big swing of the point. That summer league continues in Bloomington next week. Briefly, Peoria City Soccer hosts its first ever playoff game tomorrow night against Thunder Bay at 730.